what's up guys i want to do a quick another uh quick up on the usdt chart um i think the usdt chart um dot dominance correlates pretty well to uh bitcoin movement right um no point really looking at it on the smaller time frames on the high time frames we get some uh really good information right here we got the two week open let's just take a look at the at the weekly actually um and you can see like my trend line script has already picked up this uh looks like a broadening wedge type pattern here right like an a b c d e um let's just put that let's just label it here right and you can see uh on this entire movement up right bitcoin has been falling in price so you can see it correlates pretty well to Bitcoin movement. But one of the things I really wanted to uh, str uh, point out here is this uh, head and shoulders on the momentum indicator, right? So let's see how we could best uh, best show this. Maybe I'll just do the brush thing, right? So you have the left shoulder, the head. And we're going up for the right shoulder as uh, at the same time. What's always important is see if the squeeze is primed. And the squeeze is primed, right? And it is going up. So we have this di distribution uh, type pattern and USDT. And you can see it pretty much goes the opposite direction of Bitcoin, right? So if we wanted to kind of zoom in really quickly on, uh, on this, uh, you know, this uptrend from, um, from, um, August, right? Really quickly, we're running out of time. Um, let's just point out. It kind of looks like an, uh, you know, a internal A B C D E, right? Right here. So you know, th the bottom is close. It's just it's turning into mainly a game of patience here. All right. So there we go.